Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am trying to power through this kind of wild headache that I've had all day today. I'm not sure what is going on. Flo didn't tell me that I was supposed to get a headache today. Maybe it is next. Maybe it was yesterday that I was supposed to get a headache, but here we are having a headache today. So today... <laughs> I am reviewing the Drunk Elephant Wonder Wild Miracle Butter, which looks like this. Drunk Elephant very kindly sent this over months and months ago. I think it was April, perhaps March even. But I couldn't really give this product an honest review until I could really put it to the test. I have a normal skin and we've just recently just kind of been through spring and summer here so I didn't really have a need for it to where I could really give you an honest review until now. Um, I did put it to a test twice. Um, in situations where I really found a need for this product. So I am not getting paid to share my thoughts with you on Wonder Wild today. If you are new here, my name is Nadia and I am a licensed esthetician who loves to test and review uh, skincare products here. Uh, be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. To those who have subscribed, thank you so much. Um, and be sure to hit that notification bell so that you do not miss any future uploads. If you do hear uh, Toby, he is either sleeping and dreaming or kind of giving himself some love. Drunk Elephant describes this as marula but butter. Uh, this is an intensely nourishing concentrated salve that rescues dry, chapped, or irritated skin. Uh, Wonder Wild replenishes vital lipids to deeply nourish and strengthen a temporarily compromised skin barrier by bringing it back to its healthiest state. You can find this at Sephora and DrunkElephant.com. I will be sure to link it down below for you. A two ounce unit of this retails for $38 dollars and drunk elephant suggests that you use it uh, not only on your skin perhaps your sunburned windburned uh, chapped dry cheeks but you can also use this on your hands cuticles your elbows anywhere that your skin needs extra love nourishing rebalancing Right now, I am wearing it on my lips, and it feels really nice. It doesn't feel sticky or heavy at all. You can apply as often as needed. I do know that sometimes your eyes also become uh, dry, chapped, or irritated, um, especially like older uh, skin does tend to become very dry and chapped here along the eyes, so you can definitely use this in those areas as well. Let's chat about some ingredients here. This does have a number of oils that are beneficial to dry, chapped, irritated, or compromised skin. Marula butter is used here. A concentrated butter derived from marula oil, which is rich in antioxidants, polyphenols, lipids, and fatty acids, three, six, and nine, making it a deeply nourishing kind of treatment or salve for the skin. We also see pumpkin seed oil which also contains high amounts of omega fatty acids and beta carotene. We see green tea seed oil, a moisturizing fatty acid rich oil that comes from the seeds of the green tea plant. This plays a huge role in defending the skin against environmental generated free radical damage. We also see rosehip fruit oil, a lightweight, nourishing, moisturizing oil that comes from the seeds of rosehip fruit, high in linoleic. 
acid. There are definitely more oils included within this formula, but I definitely wanted to just discuss on some oils that I don't really touch base on within this channel. A couple of ingredients that I have discussed earlier have been jojoba, shea butter, and virgin marula, which are also included within this formula, just to name a few. So I began using this April 5th after a disastrous facial. I feel like I keep talking about this facial throughout some of my videos, um, but my skin was feeling parched, dry, rough, and pretty much on the brink of a rash. Um, so I used this under the SkinCeuticals B5 serum and my skin woke up feeling slightly better. Um, and I was worried that this would feel uh, too heavy or too sticky on the skin, but it did not. There have been a couple of instances here in my channel where I do review a product that feels just overwhelmingly heavy or sticky on the skin that I have to wake up in the middle of the night and remove it. And although this is a kind of butter or a salve, I did not have to do it with this product. And it could also be the fact that my skin really needed the nourishing oils within this that I didn't have to wake up or it didn't bother me so much that I had to wake up and walk to the sink and remove it. I used this again on April 3rd, and this time I used this under the Pharmacy Niacinamide Mask. I will link my review to that product up above in case you'd like to check it out. Uh, but Wonder Wild worked nicely over the skin. Felt like my skin the next day woke up looking more radiant and more balanced. Since it didn't feel heavy, I used Marula oil over this balm. Again, overkill, but my skin was in such rough, literally rough shape, um, that my skin actually enjoyed that little mixture. It felt quenched, it felt moisturized, um, and I wrote here that I may repeat that again. Um, so that's how much I liked that little kind of cocktail. On April 4th, I noted that it worked nicely on dry, tired hands. It did not feel um, sticky or heavy, and it worked really nicely on my cuticles, elbows, and lips. Again, I will note that when applied on the lips, it doesn't feel sticky or heavy. It just kind of feels like there's something on your lips but it just feels nice. And because there is no scent, there's nothing additionally happening to your senses. So it coats the lips nicely and you could probably use this as a lip balm as well. Very large lip balm, if you will. Um, I did use this recently two nights in a row in late August. We recently went through a heat wave here in late August, early September. My skin just became so environmentally stressed. I just needed to use this. So I applied about a pea-sized amount to my face and my skin the next day woke up rebalanced. Um, after using this two nights in a row, I did not notice any additional congestion, no additional breakouts, just balanced skin after um, excessive heat and just lots of exposure to the air conditioner, not just at home, but also at work and in the car. I'd never used a balm on my skin before until this launched. And around that time, slugging became a huge trend, not only on TikTok, but on Instagram as well. And I'd never slugged in my life before. I know that multiple people have, and that's literally all that they do to their skin. But I didn't or hadn't really done that until recently. So I think that if you love Drunk Elephant and you already slug, you may enjoy this over other slugging products. When slugging, make sure that you just use that product alone because say for example, if I apply this over TLC Framboos, I may wake up the next day with an intense chemical burn 
as this just kind of intensifies um, the effect what you're applying it under has on the skin. So do make sure that if you are slugging that you are just using this alone or perhaps some hydrating products. When I, when I do slug, the only thing that I do to my skin is cleanse and apply a pea-sized amount of this and I am good to go. This is definitely richer, more soothing, and more nourishing than any other oil that I have used, even marula oil. So I think that if you have dry, chapped, irritated skin, um, you may want to use this instead of an oil. This is definitely more of a needs-based product for me. Fall is here, so my lips will definitely get chapped. Uh, my, ha my hands do get drier during uh, fall and winter months, so I'll definitely be using it then. Even so now during spring and summer, I feel like I still go out and apply hand sanitizer after my outing. Um, especially like if I go grocery shopping, I'll just put some um, hand sanitizer. So my hands have been feeling a little bit drier, which is why sometimes I do reach for this on my hands. But as far as my face is concerned, I've only needed to use this twice uh, to treat dry, dehydrated, irritated, impaired barrier kind of chapped skin. So I feel like I don't necessarily have a use for this on like a daily even monthly basis but I do love that this is kind of a multi-purpose product um, where a little bit goes a long way so this does have a 12 month shelf life so do remember that my overall results from use have been uh, softer soothed balanced kind of rescued skin. And I typically, again, just use this alone on cleansed skin, either on my hands, lips, or elbows. Um, I would definitely not use this during the day. This does pair nicely with their marula oil if you need intense nourishing and moisture, but alone it works just fine for my dry, chapped, dehydrated skin. My favorite way to use this was just by cleansing, of course double cleansing, so I would either use a cleansing balm or a cleansing oil, best jelly cleanser, wipe that off, dry skin, and then go in with a pea-sized amount of this and we are good to go. This is definitely lazy, routine friendly, so love, love that. I would recommend this to anyone who lives in a dry, cold climate, dealing with dry, dehydrated, irritated, chapped, flaky uh, skin, or if you're dealing with an impaired barrier, um, if you're also dealing with dry, chapped lips or incredibly tired, um, dry hands, you may also use this there. I feel like if you work with your hands just like I do, you may enjoy this as kind of a soothing nighttime treatment for your hands. And who couldn't really use more hydration and nourishing on their hands? I feel like we do a lot with our hands without even realizing and we don't pay them enough attention. So my pros here is that this is a salve that goes where a little bit goes a long way. Um, again, I usually find myself using a pea-sized amount to my face, um, hands or elbows, and the tiniest bit on my lips. Um, this is a multitasking product that can be used anywhere uh, that the body needs extra love. You can add it to your cart now if your winters are dry and cool and you feel like you've tried everything but nothing seems to work, you can definitely give this a go then. And this does contain coconut oil and I did not notice any additional congestion or breakouts despite the addition of the coconut oil within this product. And granted, all I used was a pea-sized amount and I did leave it on overnight by itself. I feel like I only really needed to use this two nights in a row and then I could go 
in with my lighter hydrating serums to further rebalance, hydrate, and kind of plump the skin. I feel like perhaps if you use this more than five consecutive nights in a row, perhaps you could see the development of some congestion. And if so, you could probably go ahead and use uh, something with salicylic acid, like a salicylic acid based toner to further uh, deep clean and decongest the pores. And you can go back to using this during the night without salicylic acid. You want to make sure that you are not applying anything that is exfoliating under this. Cons, I don't really have any. I really enjoyed this and I am rating this a 10 out of 10. I find that whenever my skin needs intense moisture, repair, this will definitely do the trick within two uses on my normal skin without further congesting or causing any breakouts. A little bit goes a long way so... I could really see myself using this throughout fall and winter. I'm going to try this on my feet too. I will keep you all posted in the bottom bar or do a pinned comment. They're not as dry and I have been doing a really good job at exfoliating and um, using a pumice stone, but maybe this will help soften them a little bit further. So let me know if you have used the Drunk Elephant Wonder Wild Miracle Butter in the comments down below. What were your results? Would you recommend this to um, anyone else? Um, let's discuss that in the comments. As you all know, I have normal skin, so perhaps if you have drier skin than I do or oily skin and you've used this, let us know your results, your thoughts, your opinions in the comments down below. That is all I have for you. Thank you so much for spending some time with me today, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Delicious. You know... And my skin just became 